which is summit i believe what's going on everyone welcome to the stream guys it is pike's peak international hill climb day today guys i am so excited it's gonna be freaking awesome uh i love pike's peak international hill climb fun fact i live like three hours away from pike's peak and uh i went in 2019 was gonna go to try to go this year but things didn't work out but next year i will be going guys i absolutely love the pike's peak international hill climb all right, all right. I hope all you guys are having a fantastic day today, guys. I know I am. It is a beautiful day, day, day today. And like I said, today is the day that they're actually racing the Pikes Peak International Hill Climb. Crazy fact, they couldn't do the full race. Yeah, yeah. Build a car. A Pikes Peak uh, Hill Climb car is like 50,000 plus. <laughs> So guys, the, the crazy thing happened is they're only racing part of the the hill climb this year because last night right it snowed like a I foot of snow at the top. Of Pikes Peak. Really, Ian? I had no idea. You're in Durango? Hey man, I'm just outside Montrose. <laughs> That's fantastic, man. All right. Uh, what we're gonna do here, guys? Give me what? Give me one second, guys. Oh, that's crazy that you live in Durango. <laughs> that is insane. Are you sure you want to quit? Yes. We want to quit. We're going to restart here, guys. We're going to start off with the Audi Quattro on the dirt. Uh, the dirt uh, hill climb. Right Right now, it is... Uh, hell yeah, man. <laughs> I'm just on the other side of the Black Canyon. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what we're going to do, guys, we're going to do a gravel Pikes Peak Hill Climb first. And now uh, back about 10 years ago, they made they paved it, so now it's nothing but tarmac. But uh, we're going to do gravel first, and we're going to do it on the hardest difficulty, guys. We're going to do the full course with the uh, Audi Quattro, and we're going to be doing it in clutch and age pattern. So one of our goals today, guys, is to beat Michelle Maton's uh, Group B Audi Quattro time, guys, which is 11.25. Uh, 11.25.6, something like that. 11 minutes and 25 seconds. Yes, it takes 11 minutes to get up this mountain, which is just insane. Um, so what we're going to do, we're going to do a practice run, see how the car feels, and then we're going to start tuning it. Let me know how you guys are today, guys. Hope everyone's having a fantastic day. All right, here we go. Click that like button, guys. All right, here we go. Let's see how fast we can go. Rich Hall. What's going on, Rich? Hours away from <laughs> 18 hours and 11 minutes. 18 hours and 11 minutes. That's quite a bit away from Pike's Peak, bud. <laughs> Yes, I do have this track memorized because you don't have a... This would be a dream run for me in a quattro. Oh, I know, man. It would be incredible. So with, with hill climbs, guys, you don't have a co-pilot, so you have to memorize the track. And that's what I've done. Whoop. It's all right. We're still good. Just didn't take the optimal driving line. So we climb up. What's going on, David? How you doing, buddy? <laughs> I'm gonna try to be airborne. Oh jeez. Oh no. We hit a a straw bag. Took it a little too close there, but that's okay. It's all about getting the rotation we need here. We're just straight away. We're absolutely flying right now. And Hi, buddy. Hey, buddy. <laughs> nope, this is Dirt Rally 1.0. This is the old school 1.0, bud. <laughs> it was pretty incredible, bud. I didn't realize it used to be dirt. 
It, yeah, man, it used to be dirt for 50, 60 years of the competition, man. And then only about 10 years ago, actually, I would say almost 90 years, because this race first started in 1916, and uh, they paved it. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, Lord. Oh, good Lord. <laughs> good thing it's just practice. But, uh, yeah, they, they first started doing this race in 1916, guys. And uh, I think in 2011, 2012, almost 100 years that they raced on this in dirt. This is the most revered hill climb in the world, guys. The Pikes Peak Internet. You start off at 9,000 feet above sea level, and you finish around 14,000 feet. You diverted to the walking mode. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, how many hill climb guys do you know that can sit here and fly up this hill climb and commentate the whole time? I mean, how many people do you know who can do this and then commentate and have a good time, hold conversations? I will wait. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to start doing some uh, heel toe. We'll do heel toe action when we get to the asphalt. <laughs> oh, didn't go in gear there. Here we go, boys. And do some heel toe action, get have some fun. Oh, jeez. Here we go. This is such a tricky part now. We're coming out of the trees. Such a high speed section. I got, I don't, we've got a break right here. Oh, come on, go in gear. What's going on? David West. I still have the MK1 shell you need to get and build. Oh my God, an M an escort? MK1 Golf or MK1 Escort? If you have an MK1 Escort shell, holy mackerels. If it's a Golf, holy mackerels as well. What is it? I'm very curious. David West. Oh. Woo! Oh, that's true. Hey, man, let's build a car together. Let's build a car together and race it. Let's form a team. Let's do it, West. Everyone pressure West to build a team. We need peer pressure. By the way, West is one of the best mechanics that I've ever known. Uh, if you guys don't know, uh, me and West served in the Army together in the same unit at 3rd uh, third, third Squadron, 71st Cavalry Regiment. You know, if Lions would pull his head out of conspiracy land, he's a great guy. I really like Lions, man. I enjoyed him when we were in the army, but conspiracy land is a bit crazy these days. David West. He does have a lot of knowledge. Oh, for sure. Absolutely. I don't get me wrong. 
I really, Lions was a great man, man. He was a great guy. I, I absolutely loved his company when we were in the Army. You know that, man. And you know, you, you just know why. I mean, I both think we have an understanding. Because, yeah, I think if all three of us could really have a hell of a team, man. We all take different paths, LOL. Yeah, man, that's for sure. Here we go, boys. David West. We can leave it at that. Yeah. <laughs> For sure, buddy. Get a little rotation here. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Here we go, guys. Pushing hard. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, I missed my gear, miss my gear. Oh, we're done. Oof. Oof. David West. That man on the inside of that corner was brave. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's probably Rupert Barrington from Grassroots Motorsports trying to get a good shot. <laughs> we're going to bring this down a little bit. It's... All right, so that was a, a decent practice, guys. So now we're going to go to service area. We're going to tune the car and then get ready to, uh, to see what time we can post in. We almost got to the top. That's actually where um, a lot of people have actually passed away in that corner where I just crashed. It's off of a high speed, uh, high speed straightaway. I mean, I was in six gear. Um, is this a Delta S4? Nope, this is Audi Quattro, buddy. The Group B Audi Quattro, same one Michelle Maton. Uh, drove we're gonna do the brake bias just to the front a little bit because we're going uphill so it's not gonna be a big deal uh what we're gonna do here is we're gonna bring the differential L limited slip disc lock up to i think 45 percent. is that what i did on the first one uh we did 53 we're gonna do 47 okay suspension front we're gonna drop it down down to point 13 point 13 you want to be airborne you gotta do it my way my way or the highway 857 Quattro me. 857 on that was that on uh that's Same gotta be bone. Same as Walter Rarl as well. Yes sir. Same as Walter Roll. Absolutely. Alright, so let's uh let's start a run. Let's see what we can do. What time do you guys think I can get? Let me know what you guys think. I'm thinking maybe around eleven forty, eleven thirty, Michelle Matons. Uh, record is 11:25 in the in the Audi Quattro, and uh, on dirt surface. So we'll see what we can do on the dirt surface. Here we go. All right, let's see what we can do here, guys. Hey, if you guys are enjoying the stream, click that like, click that follow, guys. What do you mean something real? Did this is real. 1,109 if you keep it on the ground. <laughs> Woke. Oh, jeez. All right. Can't have that. Can't be doing that. David 
John's army. Where is the asphalt? I have it on gravel mode right now. We'll be doing asphalt a little bit later, buddy. No, it's only got three cars we can use for a hill climb, unfortunately, which is kind of a bummer, but... Oh yeah, absolutely. Here we go. Watch, you'll watch me do a clutch kick here in a moment. Ah, too much. All right, I need to go go in second gear in that turn. Third gear is just a little too low. Oof. What's going on, everyone? Click that like button, guys. So this is a difficult turn. Second. National Hill Climb Day today, buddy. Can everyone take part in this anytime because I want to do it too. Absolutely, man. All right, this is a very difficult corner, guys. Help me out here. As soon as I see. Now. Eugene Zaveras. Is it a normal mode? Nope, this, yeah, this is a real life hill climb, guys. I live about three hours from this hill climb in Colorado. This is the Pikes Peak International Hill Climb, bud. This is a, you, we gain about 4,000 feet of elevation going up this. Yes, sir. Eugene Zabaris. Nope. That means I can play this mode when I get the game. Yes, sir. This is on Dirt Rally 1.0, though. Thanks, guys. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Woo. 
Little too hot coming in there. Got to slow it down. So fun fact guys, this is where right here at this corner is where I watched the 2019 Pikes Peak International Hill Climb a couple years ago guys. This is called the Devil's Playground. The reason why they call it the Devil's Playground is because lightning strikes so much up here. See all these rocks this is where I was hanging out at. And lightning strikes like crazy up here man. Come on. We're flat out, guys. We're probably going like 120 miles an hour, 130 miles an hour right now. Oh! What's up, buddy? I didn't hear that. No, there isn't. There isn't, buddy. This is only on Dirt 1.0. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shoot, wrong gear. Come on, this is a very dangerous straight. We gotta pay attention. Here we go, boys. Down the fifth. Get the rotation we need. Hugo what a race for our men. Thanks, buddy. Well, Eugene Zaveris. Let me have a good check if it's available on Xbox. Woo! It should be free on Ultimate Game Pass. A 908.361? Adam and Kiriko. <laughs> Holy crap! You're absolutely flying. <laughs> 908.361! Wow! We were flying, guys! Man hell of a run. Wow! Nick Brewster. <sighs> Congratulations. Wow. Hugo Gregoire. You're the boss. That was insane. All right, let's continue. We've got run two to do now. Whew. What we're going to do here is we're going to go gears. We're just going to bring Ian up the Oppenheim. final drive one by two clicks. With a few mistakes, too. Yeah, with a and few mistakes, man. Uh, there we go. Match recommendations. F4. Thank you. All right, here we go, guys. Let's try it's run on. number two. What? Do you, what? How to set it on gravel? Um, you did, it allows you to choose, buddy. It allows you to choose in the uh, uh menu button in the menu uh section. All right, guys. So we just did uh, what was it nine ten? Do you guys think we can get into eight minutes? Let me know if you guys think we can get below eight minutes. Let's see. Two point zero, not one point zero. It's so it'll be bad. All right, here we go. All right, let's see what we can do, guys. Let's see if we can get below nine minutes.
Eugene Zavaris. Yes, you will make it, I already know it. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh. Saved it. It's alright. No more mistakes, Josh. No more mistakes. Let's go. Try that again. <laughs> Here we go. It's shaking a lot, dude. What's shaking a lot? I, I I didn't hear that, Bubba. Sorry about that. What what's shaking a lot? Some brass mungars. I mean it's shaking a lot, dude. What does that mean, Hugo? Let me know, buddy. Woo! Okay. Alright, run two. Started PP twenty eight times today. Hell yeah, buddy. Mohammed Ben Rabi. Mohammed, what's going on, buddy? All right, guys. If I can get m minus nine minutes, a uh, below nine minutes, guys. I mean, I think you guys. Uh, if you guys would like, if I can get nine below nine, let's see if you guys can donate some stars. If we get below nine. Can get a better line through there. Hugo Gregoire, dancing with the rope. Dancing with the devil today, boys. Jason Lister, below nine, Grandma shows her tatas. Below nine, Grandma shows her tatas. <laughs>
on. Let's go, boys. Come on. We got this. Sub nine minute. Not good, not good, come on. This is a hard section. Get ready, get ready to break, get ready to break, get ready to break, and now. We're about the tree line now, guys. Let's go. Oh, why'd you bug out on me? Come on. Oh no, I thought I was in, no! I was in the wrong gear. Come on. Come on, boys. Hey, if you guys are enjoying the stream, click that like button, guys. We are racing the Pikes Peak International Hill Climb today. Little trail breaking here. We're going to go down the fifth here. Yeah, buddy. Absolutely. We'll put it on replay. It's not a 12-minute replay, though. A <laughs> nine-minute replay. Come on, and break.
Hugo Gregoire. You driving skill is so good. Thumbs up sign. What did we get? We made mistakes so. Yes! We got sub 9 minute! <laughs> That's how we do it right there, guys. Even with all those mistakes, we still got a sub 9 minute. Whew! <laughs> 8 minutes and 56 seconds, point five two eight. Holy crap! Is this Dirt Rally 1? Yep, this is Dirt Rally 1, bub! Sun asterisk. Woo! Sub asterisk. Eugene Zabaris. <laughs> you are so focused. <laughs> Chris Walter. LOL, I mean just. Oh no, I pressed the wrong button! I'm so sorry, buddy! WS sexy. John Zarni. <laughs> I'm so sorry, buddy! David Carter. Wow, <sighs> that was incredible to watch. I pressed the wrong button crashed. for the. Congrats on the sub nine. <sighs> run. So sorry, guys. Ross Giggett is short all. That was awesome, lol. So sorry. We're gonna do that again, though. We're gonna do that again. And we're gonna do full course. And instead of the, using the Quattro, which one should we got use, guys? We've got the. We've got the Sport Audi Quattro S1 Pikes Peak. Uh, it's. Front engine, straight five, 598 horsepower. I know, I'm, I'm so sorry, man. So sorry. Asphalt? Asphalt? You guys want to do asphalt now? Okay, let's do asphalt. Ian Oppenheim. The Pusho is insane. Modern or... Modern hill climb or old hill climb? RHE yellow one. Let's do modern. Pogo 405, such an icon. Such an icon, 40, the 405. All right, we'll do the 405, and then we'll go into modern cars. We'll go into the modern one that Sebastian Loeb used uh, Pedro Fernandez. to do it. Yeah. Eugene Zabaris. Old, please. All right, we're going to do the 405. Red Bull is a rocket. The Red Bull is a rocket? We'll try that after this one, then. 405. All right, we did the 405. All right, so what we're gonna do here is do a suspension. We're gonna drop it down uh, to point one, uh, point minus point seven one, and we're gonna do the same for the rear gear ratio. We're gonna bring it down just a few clicks. Differential, to bring it up. Uh, we'll do about thirteen percent on the front diff, and we'll do fifteen percent on the rear diff. Brake bias, we're gonna pop it up by one. And uh, let's see how this baby goes. Let's do a practice run. All right, here we go. John Zarni, 840. John Zarni, Uh-oh, 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 okay. I've got to change steering uh, steering ratios here. Now that we're not on the on the dirt anymore, I need a I need a tight steering uh, column. Here we go. Yep, no, nope, sorry. That, uh, this tune is not gonna work. <laughs> that tune is not, we need more, uh, we need more lock differential. It's not doing what I need it to do. Oh, shoot, wrong button. Wrong button. Oh, yeah, we're gonna save and quit. Yeah, so, uh, I clicked the wrong button there, guys. <laughs> Again. Oh, man, okay. Hill climb, discard. We're gonna go Pikes Peak USA, Master AI difficulty, full course. Hill climb, 405. I got to remember, this is a mid-engine car. So it's going to handle a little bit different than the Quattro, and I just got to remember that. Um, but the problem was, when we were going there, we were getting so much understeer coming out of the corners because the differentials were so open that uh, I was just getting so much understeer. So what we're going to do now, guys, is we're just going to run it 
default and then see how it feels and then we'll go. Then we'll do some tuning. Oh my goodness! So much understeer, we gotta change that. Eugene Zabaris. Good save. Alright, she slows down quickly, so I gotta get my braking points different here. Oh, Jesus. This car. I don't know, guys. I don't know. It, there's so much understeer with this car. I don't know what to say right now. So, um... Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> we're gonna soften up that front roll bar. We're gonna bring it down by 0 0.71. We're gonna stiffen up that. Uh, we'll keep the spring. The suspension rear. Uh, we're gonna tighten it up by one, maybe. Vicious. Oh, that's why. All right. Thanks for thanks for the follow, buddy. Hey, if you guys are enjoying the stream, click that like, guys. Eugene Zabaris. Okay, can you go do some hill climb again? Eugene, that's what we're doing right now, man. This is hill climb. What do you think we're doing? I'm just I'm just tuning. It's just the same track. It's just paved. There we go. I think we got more turn in now. All right, so what we're going to... I'm kind of getting the idea of how to drive this car. I got to be a lot less gr aggressive than I would... Oh, what happened? Okay. <laughs> I've got to be a lot less aggressive than I was before on the dirt. So what I'm going to do is elongate this final drive big time. And uh, differential. We're going to go 33% in the front. 35% on the rear. Viscous. Or bring it down by another click. All right, this should do it, guys. This should do it. We're going to turn our steering wheel column down to 400. John Zarni. I will try. 
That's awesome, John. Good for you, buddy. Let me know how you do. Congratulations, 100 comments today. Oh no, don't go off. Oh no, saved it. What are you talking about, Bob? Oh no! On my side, it's like a other language. So sorry. Woo! Dang it! <laughs> no! All right, cars feeling great, guys. We're doing pretty good. Uh, the braking, we're locking up just a little too much on the braking. So, uh, but I think we're ready to do our run. So, the thing that I've learned with this car and and on the asphalt section. Oops. Is that oh, wow. you have to be really patient with your uh, throttle uh, inputs. So you can't just be like, you know, power drifting it all the time. This is Dirt Rally 1.0, buddy. So yeah, you can't just power drift it through every corner. It's got to be, uh, it's got to be really, you know, patient and then give it because I, it's, it's, we're, I mean, we're hitting this at high speeds, guys. All right, we're going to do our run here. All right, give me one second. We're, what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on the HUD for you guys. So... Ryan Miller. What up, Doss? What, what up, Ryan? So My day's going pretty good, guys. Uh, it'd be a lot better if all yeah, of you guys could press that uh, like Josh. button, guys. Neely is typing in a language that doesn't use the alphabet we are used to. Oh. That's okay, guys. Some people use, some people use uh different languages. You could uh, I'm not sure exactly you know how to. What he's saying, if somebody could press uh translation. All right, here we go. Let's do our first run, guys. Tell Rosa, oh. what's up? What's up, buddy? How you guys doing? Click that share button, guys. Let's get as many people as we can in here. Rosa. 
Here we go. Hello, Hello buddy. How's it going? Okay, what in the cheese? What in the cheese? Guess I... Oh, you know what? Okay, for a second run, we got to adjust our uh, our preload Cameron into our differentials. Kill it, brother. What's going on, Cameron? Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Stay on, stay on. Yeah, I need to fix that differential, man. It's the differential that's screwing me over here. That's why you hear me popping the gas a lot. I need the differential to keep the... I need it so when I lift off the gas, the differential is still active. And our problem is right now... This is Dirt Rally 1.0, buddy. The problem is our diff isn't active when we lift off the accelerator, and that's why we're just careening off the edges a lot. So I have to pop the throttle to keep the differentials active, to keep our traction going. Hey, buddy, I know some people, you know, it's, they're just saying they can't understand you, buddy. I know there's a lot of different languages. I grew up in, you know, in Italy and Germany for my whole life for about 20 years. So I completely understand. They just, we just can't understand you. And there's not a translation button, unfortunately. So, but I'm pretty sure that's Greek. I may be wrong. Are you Greek, buddy? Yeah, these differentials are killing me. Nope, nope. All right, we've got to change these dif differentials, guys. We have got to. I mean, they're killing us so bad. Once we can get these differentials dialed in, man, we'll be out. This car will be killer. And it's just right now, it is. It is not killer. <laughs> it is uh. Quite the opposite. John Zarni. Hello from Germany, Rurgebiet. Yeah, I'm from Germany. My brother lives in Germany. All right, 59 pounds. Let's try that. Neely Borisova. Thermo and I are from Brazil. Oh, from Brazil. Hell yeah, man. Thanks so much for coming by. Hey, guys, let me know where you guys are watching from. Thanks, Dewey. I hope, uh, let me know where you guys are watching from. I'd be really curious to see where everyone is watching from, man. It is like, it seems to me we've got a great crowd here. And, uh, yeah. There we go. All right, let's see if we've got this car dialed in. I hope we do. Hello from Portugal. 
Portugal, UK. It's got some improvement. It's got a little bit of improvement. Holland, what's going on, Marco? Thanks for the share, guys. All right, I think the differential is okay now. Still a little tough to deal with, but we'll have to. Yeah, the understeer is still pretty bad. Okay. Ian Oppenheim. Kind of a lot of bad LOL. Tyrone Goldman. Shout out to Cape Town. Cape Town, South, Af South Africa, what's up? Thanks, buddy. I appreciate it, man. Different parts of the world in the stream right now. Dos thumbs up sign. Hell yeah, we got people from all over the world, guys. It's incredible. We need. We need more speed. Jesus. What is going on, guys? I mean, the diff. I, I can't seem to tune this car right. You know, it's. It, 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 I'm trying. I really am. I just don't think I can get this car tuned right. We're gonna go with the modern hill climb car now, guys. Uh, I'm. <laughs> I'm struggling way too much with this car. It is. Uh, I, I'm trying to get. I'm trying to tune it right, and it's just. It's not doing what I want it to do. So it, it's a bit. It's a bit frustrating. Uh, you know, I'm trying to, you know, mess with the differentials. Maybe I needed to bring the differential preload all the way down. Um, but, you know, we'd be here all day trying to get this car fixed. And, you know, what, we don't have time for that, boys. We don't have time for that. That Red Bull car is going to be a lot more fun. Yeah, is there? Oh, we're in the middle. Here we go. Here we go. Hi, Long Stewie. Ain't nobody got time for that, boys. Oh, no. Woo, 99, almost 100, buddy. How long for you, buddy? Sam 
Hell yeah, bud! Oh jeez, I forgot where I was at. Ah! This car is so quick! Holy crap! This car is so freaking quick! Oh my god, it's just like a... You weren't kidding! It's like a freaking rocket! Wow! Now this is going to be fun. We're going to bring down the height <laughs> the really low. So this car just absolutely hugs the... Uh... Yeah, it's just going to hug it, man. So what we're going to do here is go gears. Mind that boulder. Yeah. Seriously, man. <laughs> this is incredible. This is absolutely incredible. This car is fun. Ian All right. Oppenheim. Let's try this again. That car won the overall time in 2017, right? I think so. Yeah, I believe so. I believe this is the record holding car until the uh the Volkswagen IDR came along. How long, Ryan? Oh, no. No! Woo! Come on. Hell yeah, Ryan. All of to 100, buddy. I just gotta get used to the speed of this car. This is ridiculous. We still need to adjust our gear ratio. Because uh, we're, we're still topping out a little too early. Oh! Ooh. Wow. <laughs> wow. That's all I can say. I mean, this car is just so quick. Doing it in H pattern and clutch is so, so not easy. Like this is and I'm trying to do it heel toe as well. Whew. I swear to God when I tried this in VR I nearly shat my pants. <laughs> How's it going? Pants, hey? <laughs> What's it's going life. on, buddy? And tightly closed eyes. All right. Tyler Vardy. <laughs> it is man the car is insane. Dakota Falls. WTF was that not just a hay bale. Sweet wood. What happened there, bro? I hit a I hit a, a hay bale that acted like a concrete barrier, I guess. <laughs> I mean, it pretty much acted like a concrete barrier. So, um, whoops. <laughs> We're just adjusting some things real quick, guys. Seeing how it'll work. You know what? Let's just slam it on its butt. Let's see. Oops, wrong button. Let's see what, how it will work. Let's tighten up Stewie the suspension Wood. by one click. Supportage. Whoa! Thank you so much, Stewie! You are an absolute legend, guys. Hey, click that like button, guys! It'd be much appreciated. Wood. Let's go this view. Months. Now you guys can see the speedometer. Let's go, helicopter.
We'll get it. No more fancy footwork. We're just gonna get this car up the hill and see what kind of time we can do. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate it. Click that share button, guys. Let's get as many people in here as we can. Thanks for the share, buddy. There is a concrete hay bale on the inside of that corner. That was not there on the dirt run. Okay. So the car is good. We're going to go straight into our run, guys. We're just going to finish this practice run. We just got to get across the uh, start line here. All right. Return to service area. All right, we're going to start our run here now, guys. We're going to try to see how how fast we can get up this mountain, guys. We're going to go against the hardest difficulty this game has to offer. Let me know what times you guys think. I think we can get a sub eight minute. What do you guys think I can get? All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Here we go. This is the for real deal now. Brian Miller. Full send ahead. Let's go, Doss.
Got a straightaway here. Here we go. We're up to 145, 150 miles an hour. Ryan Miller, just remember you are central in this car, so give yourself a little bit more room on the left. Could be why you hit them concrete hay bales face with tears of joy. Probably. It makes sense. I'm not used to driving in the center of a car. Thanks, David. Appreciate it, guys. If you guys are interested in checking out my merchandise, you can go to that link that David Carter just dropped, and you can find my merchandise there. And it's pretty kick-ass merchandise, guys. Top quality gear. Click that like button, guys. It'd be much appreciated. Thanks for the follow, buddy. I know, Steven, I know, man, it could have been... Too fast. Nope, 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 nope. Something. No, <laughs> we were doing so good. 
Fuck! <laughs> Damn it! Alright, so what we're gonna try doing here, guys, is, uh... What we're gonna do is... We're gonna try... Something real quick. We're gonna try a, uh, we're gonna try in sequential stick. What the car was designed to do. Uh, we're gonna, we're just gonna see what kind of speeds we can do here. Yeah, that was a big crash. That was a really big crash. I mean, but if you think about it, we were just so, I mean, inches. If we were just a few inches to the right, we would have been perfectly fine. Could be worse. The right side of devils. Yeah, 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 yeah. The right side of devils would have, that could have been really bad. That's for sure. I went to, uh, that's where I was at when I went to go watch the 2019 Pikes Peak Hill Climb, guys, was, uh, I was at the Devil's Playground, and oh my god, it's like 10,000, 11,000 feet high, it's almost like 3,000 meters, man, like, the breathing was so hard, <laughs> Ooh, I was just, uh, at that time, still getting used to high altitude here in Colorado, and, uh, oh my goodness. That was a bit crazy. My first time really being at that high of an elevation, and it just whooped my butt. That is for sure. Okay, we're looking for my sequential. Oh, there, it's right in front of me. All right, here we go. We're just putting sequential plate on. Give me one second, guys. Just got to get my Allen key on. And just tightening down the bolts. Almost done. I need to get like a little Allen wrench screw gun. Just bzz, bzz, bzz. Be like NASCAR over here. <laughs> just a quick gearbox change from H pattern to sequential. I mean, this car is great, but it's just really quick for H pattern use. And it wasn't even designed Ryan for H pattern, so. How is the H pattern shifter holding up? Oh, it's doing great, man. I'm really happy with, uh, with, uh, um, I'm going to be doing a review for, uh, V&M here pretty soon. Sweet wood. I was just wondering if should get my top fan badge as I have been the most active bro. Oh, man, you should be getting it very soon, buddy. I don't know why you haven't gotten it yet. Manual sequential. All right, and then we're going to go to controls here. And then up and down. There we go. All right. The car was designed for sequential gearbox, and that's what we're going to be using now. We were using H pattern just to have fun, but for uh, the sequential is going to be the uh, the way to go with this car. So here we go. If you boys had any balls, you would race me back down. I'd race Michelle Baton. Michelle Maton. Eugene Zabaris. You driving a pile of feces, pile of feces, pile of feces, pile of feces out of this car.
you call Crowder? Which dirt rally is this? Dirt rally one, buddy! Randy Sutterfield. I hate how he breaks with his left foot. Why do you hate how I break with my left foot, bud? That's how pretty much all race cars are driven these days. That's pretty much all race cars these days, guys. My brake pedal's coming apart. We've got to get to the end of this race, guys, to the top of this hill. My brake pedal is falling apart. I can feel it creaking. Yep, fuck my brake pedal. Replying to Randy Sutterfield. No! I don't understand why. James Wilkinson. Got some skills, Bigman. Thanks, buddy. Yep, yep, that's what happened right there, boys. That's what happened. One of my one of my uh bolts came loose. So I apologize. Let me get this fixed real quick. Almost done. Luckily I've got my hand <laughs> Luckily I've done this a few times. There we go. There we go. All right. Brake pedal is coming apart, guys. Well, there was only one bolt holding on to it, and I could feel it as I was braking. Uh, I wasn't getting, you know, I wasn't getting the full braking that I needed. So, quick, quick repair on the side of the mountains here. We oh, geez, we're in reverse. All right, here we go. Come on, boys! Oh no, oh no, oh uh, no! Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Petter Solberg had his steering wheel come off on stage, but he didn't crash. <laughs> yeah, but he also had a co pilot reaching over him, Steve, <laughs> with, a, with, with Phil Mills ratcheting that shit down. Phil was like, What do you mean? What do you want me to do? The tools are in the back. And Petter was like, Get the fucking tools! <laughs> One of the greatest uh, times in rally history right there, man. All right, pedals are fixed. Here we go. I mean, I really didn't crash. I just kind of came to a stop on a hairpin. Here we go, boys. All right, now we don't have a broken pedal. Let's push as hard as we can. Use the ditch to my advantage. We're going over 145 miles, 150 miles an hour. Come on. Another 150 miles an hour, here we go, and break. No! All right, I need go-go juice. 
We're gonna go get some coffee. Give me two seconds, guys. Stephen Warren. Whew. It's no easy feat driving at 10 tenths for 12 to 13 minutes. It is not easy, guys. We're gonna go get some coffee real quick. We'll be right back. Uh, just give me two minutes, guys. I'm gonna put you guys in, uh, oh, that's what happened to my thing. We're gonna put you guys here in the lobby mode. Check out this, uh, while I'm getting some coffee, check out this map, guys. It'll tell you all the, the corners and stuff. And, uh, yeah, man. This is a, uh, it's an incredible hill climb. Be right back, boys. Alright, alright, I'm back boys, what's going on guys? Alright, I've got my go-go juice. Luckily I already had a cup already made. <clears throat> alright. Let's see what we can do here boys. I know the music is still on, but uh, may that might give me some uh, pump up action here might add to the intensity here we go All right, here we go. Eugene Zabaris, who put an angry emote to the pin comment. No! <laughs> Why is this so challenging, guys? We're gonna go back to the dirt here. We're gonna go back to the dirt and have some fun. Back to the dirt we go, boys! 
they unfortunately, guys, don't have the Lancia Stratus uh, for um, for this hill climb, which is which is a bummer. You know, they only give us a few cars to be able to use on this hill climb. We're gonna be going back to H pattern, guys. Uh, we're going back to uh, the dirt hill climb uh, because the dirt hill climb is the best. And yeah, we're gonna go with like two sectors. Yeah, there we go. Full course and full course. And we're going to be driving the, the Quattro. So my best time was eight uh, 850, 856, I think, is my best time here. And uh, we're going to try to get better than that. Um, we're going to be driving on the dirt, which is going to be fantastic. This is what this is my bomb. Di oh, my God, it's in the rain. I did not take an account for that. I did not realize it was going to be raining. This, 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 guys, is going to be really, really challenging. Um, in the rain, <laughs> H pattern clutch. We're just switching it from sequential right now, guys. So just give me a moment. Just Steven undoing. Warren. Steven! Sweet. LOL. Oh yeah, we're definitely going on the dirt, bub. Just going back to H pattern now. I like sequential and all, but H pattern is, uh, that's where I feel at most at home. So, all right. Here, just tightening them in. Like I said, guys, I'm gonna look online for like a like a screwdriver type, like with an Allen wrench fitting, so I could just hook this Allen wrench in and it just tighten it down like instantly. <laughs> just boom! instead of sitting sitting here and doing it by hand, it would be nice to have like a little handheld little Allen wrench gun, man. Just well, we'll have to do it timed. You know, you guys will have to time me and see how quickly I can do it. <laughs> all right all right here we go we've got this we've got the h pattern mode on uh we're gonna go practice options preferences we're gonna go back to manual h pattern with clutch controls let's make sure Sweet woo. yep there we go someone's pinned an angry emoji on a comment Oh, somebody's done an angry emoji? Why has somebody Steve done Warren. an angry emoji? I... I was there with Michelle Mouton ran this. That's incredible, man. That is... That's incredible, Steve. That's... Wow. Lucky man. <laughs> she was a beautiful lady and a hell of a racer. All right, here we go. Here we go. I've got to turn down my colon fifty six point nine thirty. Stephen Warren. I had a hell of a crush on her. Oh, I bet you do. I would too. Eugene Zabaris. Replying to Steve Reed. I know. Don't worry about the angry emoji, buddy. Some people just do it. It might have been on accident.
a nice Bronco. You guys see that Bronco on the side of the road? That was a nice Bronco. Oh, jeez, a little early. A little early. Whoopsies! I don't know how that worked. <laughs> wow. Look at that! Stephen Warren, right for a cut. Devin Lindbergh, what game? Dirt Rally 1.0, Bob. Nice. Nice, buddy. I've got the DD2. Well done, bud. Stein. How you doing, Stein? that me or did, did, did anybody hear that metal clinking what might be my tools or somebody else's in the house tools but I just heard some metal clinking we'll have to check the setup Yeah, buddy, it's great seeing ba it's great seeing you again, man. Nice, buddy. Oh, come on. Why didn't you go in gear? That was weird. Eugene Zabaris, when you said maybe it's someone else in the house too, so how many people is in the house if I may ask? Uh, just three. Hello, 
Come on, boys. Here we go. Uh. Stephen Moore. Bring it home, brother. <laughs> Eugene Zaveras. Are they also playing this type of games? No, no, just me. I won't, but he did win the like 2019 year I went to go watch Pikes Peak, so maybe I should pull up Estrana. Yeah, that was Dash Man! That was Dash Man! <laughs> Steve, what about Ken Block, bro? Ken Block, I don't think he's ever done Pike Speak. Maybe, maybe, I don't, I mean, he's done... This would make two awesome rally stages have one stage up and the other stage down. Oh, I could not imagine doing this down downhill, man. <laughs> that would be so insane. All right, so we're going to do a setup real quick of this car. Uh, we're going to... What we're going to do is we're going to extend the gear ratios all the way. Bring them out. Bring them out. There. Bring them out. There we go. And then we're going to bring it down a little bit uh, suspension we're gonna one two three bring it down to zero one two three brake bias we're gonna go like that all right let's go do a run let's see if we can get sub nine minute in the rain guys in the rain you gotta get some of my go go juice hey if you guys are enjoying the stream click that like button click that follow guys and click on that notification bell in the top right corner uh, once you click on it, it'll get, prompt you to choose, uh, notify you every time I go live. It'll let you know every time I post new content and go live, guys. So click that notification button. And, uh, yeah, click that share button, too, guys. Let's see if how many people we can get in the stream today. All right, here we go. Clutch in, handbrake, engage. Here we go. Yeah, I mean he does a little. He does rally here in the United States, that's for sure. But I don't think Ken Block has ever competed in a Pikes Peak. He he made a Jim Connor on Pikes Peak, but I don't think he actually ever competed. I could be wrong. Somebody cor uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Steve might know, but I just don't think he's ever actually competed in the Pikes Peak International Hill Climb.
120, 130, 140. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Uh, that's what I thought. Dirt Rally 1.0, buddy. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Rikus! Holy crap, Rikus, how are you doing, my South African friend? How's it going overseas, buddy? How South Africa treating you? Scotty Honeybone. He is a Gymkhana and rally driver. Travis Pastrana does Pikes Peak almost every year. Tanner Faust has done it this year as well. I just watched him this morning. I don't know if Travis, I think Travis is doing it this year. They usually do the Porsche Cup. I think Travis invited uh, Tanner this year. Uh, I thought I could do it. We had the nice, perfect long drift, but it was just a little too early. Steve Ruth, just wondering if you saw the video of Travis Pastrana and the Madman Page Bro. Rico's heading. Oh yeah, with the Jim Connor buddy. Great, but great being able to watch your stream again. Hell yeah, buddy. I'm glad things aren't... I, I'm, I'm sorry things aren't going as great, but... I'm glad, uh, you know, I'm sad to think things aren't going great, but I'm glad you're here. Get to hang out, buddy. Eugene Zaveris. Replying to Rika's hat Where in South Africa are you? Oh, what the hell? Those damn hay bales, man. Those darn hay bales. I tell you. I tell you, man. They are, they are, they are some mischief, uh, mischievous hay bales. Like, you would think, okay, I'd clip it. You know, it hit me wrong a little bit. But, uh, to completely move my car it's just a bit ridiculous He's doing some rallying stuff on the streets and doing some jumps yeah that's the Jim Connor buddy Travis took over the Jim Connor if you didn't know that yeah that was his first Jim Connor video yeah he took over for Ken block for uh, the the Jim Connors and that was with the Subaru instead of uh, the Fords that uh, Ken always does Riku's heading fun fact I used to fun fact I used to live in uh in Maryland, and I used to go to college before I joined the United Scotty States Army, home. and, uh... This wet clay surface would like rallying on soap. <coughs> yeah, man. So, yeah, I used to go to college, and, uh, I used to have to take the city bus to school. And, uh, and every time that we, uh, along the bus route... Jesus. Along the bus route, I would have to go right past through the, uh, Annapolis town, town center where they did the race for the Jim Connor. No worries, man. But yeah, so uh, I used to go on my way to school to uh, community college, take the bus, and it would uh, along our bus route we'd have to go into the middle of Annapolis. And Annapolis, in the middle of the town center of Annapolis, is where they shot Travis Pastrana jumping over the water and doing all those stunts and everything, going to the U.S. Naval Academy and stuff. And I used to go drive. I used to drive by that every day. And then my girlfriend at the time got a car, and uh, on our way home we'd all every day pass Travis Pastrana's house. In Maryland. <laughs> yeah. Travis is such a cool guy, man. <laughs> Here we go. Ow. 
I've lived a lot of places in my life, guys. So, <laughs> I've lived everywhere, man. Yeah, he is. I love, I love Trip Pastrana. He's one of my, one of my uh, biggest inspirations in driving. Yes, sir. Yeah, I've been everywhere, man. I was born in Germany, lived there for eight years, 12 years in Italy, a year and a half in Maryland, six months in Virginia, five years in New York, nine months, uh, three months in Oklahoma at Fort Sill, four months at Fort Huachuca, Arizona, year and a half in Florida and then three years here in Colorado oh yeah Th that's how Travis is huge Scotty if you didn't know that that's how Travis got his fame was Supercross the dude is insane at, on motorcycles four wheel four wheels is not his original thing it's always been uh, motorcycles. Travis is an absolute freak. Looking to move again? Probably. Man, I'm not. I'm never content in one spot. I like to see the world, man. Number one hundred and ninety-nine. One ninety-nine, Bob. Yes, sir. Uh, Call McRae, you mean? Who was from Scotland? Yeah, it was a very sad day. I used to watch him as a kid. So I adjusted my steering wheel rotation and now I can steer the wheel really well. I had it too had it too twitchy to be able to get these good power slides in. Scotty Honeybone. Colin McRae died way too young. Scotty yeah, he did. Yeah, that's him. I think it was a helicopter crash, wasn't it, bro? Yep, with him and his son, I believe. One one of his sons. Come on, Josh, get your head out of your, out of your expletive and get racing here. Nope, nope. Scotty Honeybone, that's the ones to be a very sad day. Very, very sad day, guys. Thanks for the like, buddy. Yes, yeah, sir. I. That's when I watched rally all the time, man. That's when I got into rallying, watching Colin, Carlos Sainz, Petter Solberg, all duking it out, man. Marcus Granholm. Marcus in a two o uh, two o eight. Or 306, or 206, I think. Mark, yeah, Mark is in the 206, Petter in the Subaru, uh, McCray in the Ford, Signs in the Subaru, Loeb in the Citron, and then Ro Rovan Para in the Skoda. That's all I can remember on top of my head while I'm racing and commentating. Yeah, 
Oh, I'm a diehard fan when it comes to rally, guys. Yeah, he was when when he rolled over and kept going. <laughs> that was incredible. Oh yeah, Colin McRae is the goat for pretty much everyone. And Richard Burns, yep, thank you. Yeah, man. I knew I was forgetting somebody. Thanks for... Sorry, I, I can always do so much while racing and con and keeping conversation. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I do the best I can. Oh, I love the whole attitudes of all the guys in the early 2000s, man. Like, oh, you want me to relinquish my run to my teammate? Oh, hell no. I'm going to go faster and defy all team orders, like Colin McRae did. <laughs> Buddy, you know, still trying to afford money to be able to put a cage in my car, but it's going great. Car's ready for rally cross. Car's going great for rally cross, and it's ready to rock and roll, man. Oh no! Damn it! I'm trying, guys! D. Derek J. Johnstone, what event are you on today? Hikes Peak Do International Hill Climb, buddy! Plus the Welsh Rally Driver 2 Pro. Al Evans or his father? Which Evans are we talking about? Or are we talking about an Evans at all? Yeah, this car is so messed up right now. Yeah, we've got a puncture. Audi Quattro right now, bub. Yeah, we've got a puncture. Yeah, we've definitely got a puncture. No! Riku's That is great. So we put a new exhaust on our kin and Maverick, you must hear that bad boy now. Oh man. Oh, I can't. Send me a send me a video, buddy. Old school Audi, I assume. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 
Windaff and Ellen Evans. Windaff. Oh yeah. So do you have sponsors for if you crash? Derek <laughs> yeah. J. Johnstone. Uh, not qu I mean, in real life or in this? In real life? No. In this? Sure. <laughs> Alright, we're going to bring down the final drive more. And, uh, let's try this. Uh, we've got another run to do. R run number two. Yes, I would like to repair it. Yes. Uh, there, and at four... There we go, and start run. All right, so we adjusted the gear ratios here and adjusted the differential, so. Here we go. So the car should perform better now, especially in power slides. Oh, we need to uh, move my coffee so I don't hit coffee everywhere and cry Eugene's because I ruined all my electronics. Real live. Oh, Eugene, no. <laughs> no, not yet. Not yet. We'll get there someday. But uh, we're not there yet, Go. If you guys want to help me with that, that would be incredible by sending some stars. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yeah, there we go. Now the car differential is a little bit more locked so we can get the power slides going. Here we go. D. Derek J. Johnstone. You will need lots of stars faced with tears of joy. Yes, lots and lots of stars. <laughs> yes, now the car is so much easier to handle now, guys. We can really push hard now. Yes! This is what I'm talking about right now, boys. Put some Tokyo Drift on right now. D. Derek J. Johnstone. Did you change setup to 60-40 split? Ah, uh, yeah, kind of. Oh, now it's slow down! Many stars you have got, roughly. Say, can you say it one more time, Stewie? I didn't hear that, buddy. We're going to restart that one. Sorry, guys. Came in a little too hot. All right, here we go. Clutch in, handbrake engage. Run two. Here we go. Do you know how many stars you have got? Oh. Uh, total. Total with uh. Since I started streaming. Okay, buddy, I will. Thanks so much, Rikus. Um, I don't know, maybe a couple hundred. I've made a well a couple thousand dollars uh, in the last two years, so. You did, buddy. Oh yeah, I know. I'm uh. Oh yeah, I'm. You know, I'm saving up money on my end as well. But any help, you know, any help from you guys would be much appreciated. I feel like sometimes I'm building two cars because this uh. This Audi, uh, this rig <laughs> costs as much as I put into my, my Subaru. <laughs> and I put thousands into this rig, man. Alright, here we go, boys. Thanks for the likes, guys. 
Click that follow button too, guys. We're trying to hit 16,000 followers. Oh, did not mean to do that. Uh, I'm not entirely sure off the top of my head. I'm not entirely sure what exact turbo is in it. It's the one that I bought it with, but I know it's not... I know it's not stock. I know that for sure. I just haven't taken the turbo out to actually see what it is. Here we go, guys. Nice little Scandinavian flick. Hell yeah, buddy! Nice! I've got around 300 in mine. I've got a full grim speed downpipe and exhaust system. Why do you die out on me so much, car? Come on. I know we're gaining altitude, but come on. Rikus! Rikus! Next rally cross race. When I can get across the, ro the Rocky Mountain Range? <laughs> I just got to get my car across the Rocky Mountains to the next race, and that's, that's a big journey. I have to cross a whole mountain range to go rally cross. D. Derek J. Johnstone. Mine is a basic off turbo classic with 265 bhp just now. It should be well lower as nothing has changed far the exhaust so far. Face with tears of joy. No! Dang it! <laughs> Damn it! I'm trying, guys! Just floor it, you will make it. D. Derek J. Johnstone. My fault. No, not your fault. Here we go, here we go, here we go! Scotty Honeybone. Go! Scotty 
Scotty! Talking of Subarus, there is a new class here in the NZRC where they are all powered by the H6 engine and they call it Class H. Darren Carter, Interesting! Car has had more hits than the Beatles. That's an interesting class, Scotty. I'm gonna have to look that up. Do you have any? Can you send me some information on that? D. Derek J. Johnstone. It's okay. I am laughing. Have a great stream. All right, good, buddy. I'm glad you're having a good one, man. If you're not first, you're last, buddy. <laughs> no, -uh, I, I didn't lose the grandma. Earlier, you said if I got sub eight, and I did. Jason, I don't think you were here. Thanks, Jason. This one is the third gear. Scotty Honeybone. But they all run the GC8 body. Oh, that's an awesome body. Jason Lister. I, I think. For a bit, but <laughs> no worries, buddy. No worries. Okay, a 926 in the rain. We need to go better. Dang it. <laughs> Scotty Honeybone. Any Kyle Larson fans on here today? Uh, you know, you know, I, I am, I, I am very impressed with his driving on the dirt and on the oval uh, asphalt, but his previous comments that he's made while stream while streaming hey Doss, what game uh you? i'm not a That's fan of at all speak, right? yes sir this is dirt rally 1.0 and this is pike's peak international raceway and so now we're like that. We're on the dry now, boys. Hey, guys. You guys enjoy the stream? Click that like. Click that follow, guys. Yes. I, would you like to repair it? Yes. F4. All right. Here we go. Oops. Howdy do, brother. Hey, buddy, how you doing, man? I'm doing pretty good. Hope you're doing well. We're gonna try hood view and see how well we can do on hood view. Oh, me neither, uh, Scotty. Me neither, buddy. Let's see how fast we can go in this view, guys. Oh, uh, too early. I mean, I, I feel like we were flying there. Just give her ER. Just give her, man. 
Come on you newbies please hit that follow and the like and the share buttons please don't ignore this please guys. Thanks Dewey. Appreciate that buddy. Yeah guys hit that like button. Smash those reaction buttons. I'm going to go as flat out as I can here. That's why we're on the hood view. Let's see what kind of time we can get. Now I can push really hard. I'm not in cockpit. Hood view, it has been proven to be the fastest view if you're trying to go as fast as you can. Hafiz Abdullah. Fans from Malaysia. Malaysia! Man, I've got fans all over, man. That's incredible. Can you imagine what the safari rally is gonna feel like in your new motion rig when you get it? Oh my goodness. I'm gonna need a full Han system. Scotty, that's for sure. Damn it! <laughs> We're going so quickly! Holy crap, guys! We are going so quickly, man! Like, we are flying. I think we can break a, uh, a personal best here, easily. I think we can get, like, 8.30. I'm not kidding. If we push like this, I think we can get 8.30. What do you guys think? Let me know. Uh, our best is an 8.56. Our best is an 8.56. Let's see if we can get it. Scotty Honeybone. 8.31. 8.31. All right. Let's see if we can do it. Eugene Zaveras. Yes, of course you can. Thanks, Eugene. Rikus Hatting. Buddy, nice seeing you again. Thanks, Rikus. Alright, buddy, I look forward to seeing you again. When you have a great day, bub. Antonio Rui Mota. This feels fast as hell. It does. I feel like it it we're going really quick. How you doing, Mike? Benny J. Kalaki. Is that Eddie the Evil? Is that what? How you doing today, Mike? Tears of joy. Met something metal just came out. Something metal just came out. I felt it and heard it. Okay. Maybe not. Maybe no metal came out. But I did I did feel it. I did you guys hear it too? Maybe you guys heard it through the mic. But I heard something metal. Sweet yeah. Alright, if you guys heard it too, I'm not losing my mind. Hayden 
patents ev would probably run out of battery power of PPHC LOL. I don't know, not true man, cause uh there's a Tesla the record the fastest car ever to go up Pikes Peak with an electric car. Like electric cars hold the record. Scotty Honeybone. That Volkswagen thingy. Yep. The IDR. Cameron Cows Land, Lee Simpson. Cameron Cowsland. Evening John. What's going on, Cameron? The car is really bogging out now that we're getting high elevation, guys. We lose about 30% power as we climb up this mountain that is an absolute Turbo. fact Turbo JP underscore acoustic. Hello. Smiley face. What's going on, buddy? How you doing? Thanks for the like, buddy! MJP underscore acoustic. I'm really well. How are you? I'm good, buddy. I'm good. I'm racing Pikes Peak. So I'm having a good day today, bub. Hope you're having a great day. Eugene Zavaris. Oh, I almost forget to tell you I went to sleep at 3.30 this morning and woke up at 11.42 so you can call me an addicted person to rally games face with tears of joy. For oh man! Joy. Well, I'm glad you're having fun, but I could not do that. If I was gonna build a hill from special ID, build a lightweight Ford Sierra RS500 with RS200 running gear with a SODAV transmission with two Garrett 34 turbos pumping out well over 1,500 horsepower. Nice, Scotty. That sounds like a badass build, bud.
What do we get? What do we get? <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, we got an 850, man. <laughs> Woo! Almost done. White heavy check mark. White heavy check mark. With this game, I'm so happy. 850, guys. We just beat the hardest difficulty by 21 freaking seconds, man. 21 seconds. Dewald Swart. Shout out to Mike Oxlong. Mike Oxlong, what's going on, buddy? Woo! That was that was tough, boys. Holy Macatoons. The Audi Sport Quattro. Wow, surprised face. What'd you think I was driving, bud? <laughs> What'd you think I was driving? You think I was driving a Tesla? <laughs> Although Stop Tesla would be pretty good on this. <laughs> jump on the tarmac and have a go. All right, let's let's jump on the tarmac. We're gonna keep the Quattro though. Uh, I've got to bring this down to like 450 degree steering wheel now. Discard, Pikes Peak, USA, Master. Master, 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 a puppet a pulling your strings, twisting your mind fast as your dreams. What song is that? Whoever can get, whoever gets that song is amazing. Master, master, a puppet a pulling your strings, twisting your mind fast as your dreams. <laughs> what a great song. All right. <laughs> a 901. Ooh. So we're going to go suspension. Obey your master. That's a great song, man. Scotty Honeybone. 8.25 then. 8.25? Scotty. Scotty is just like, this is what you're getting, bro. You have no choice. We'll try. We will try. Standings. 8.25. Here we go. Shez Horton. Metallic. Metallica, buddy! Yeah, buddy! Which view? This view? The first view? Second view? Or... Oops. Or third view? First, second, or third view? All good, brother, no pressure. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> Click that like button, guys. It would be much appreciated. And also, if you guys could share this. Oh, my gosh. We're restarting. What a goofy start. If you guys could share this into as many gaming groups, that would be incredible. This time. Eugene Zabaris. The full car, please. I can't drive in full car, Bob. I'm sorry.
Is there like a tire choice I can change? <laughs> like, this car just, it just, I have to take it really slow. Like, this is nuts. Thanks, guys! I don't know how people can play car games slash sims in third person view AE. Yeah, I Alright, I need to change my steering rotation down to 400. Alright, let's try this. There we go, now now it's turned in more. There we go. Alright, I'm going to start heel towing it now. Let's have some fun. Okay, we're gonna choose a different car. The thing, the, the thing just slides. It's worse on asphalt than it is on dirt. I'm not kidding. It literally is worse on asphalt than it is on dirt. At least dirt, I have more traction. I'm not kidding. I have more traction on the dirt than I do uh, with that car. Like, come on, <laughs> come on. <laughs> dirt, that was the one bad thing about Jerome Dirt Hughes. Dirt Rally 1.0 is Hi, that buddy. the asphalt was horrible. Hey, buddy, how's it going? You slide more on asphalt than you do on... Peugeot 205. Yeah, we're, we're doing uh, modern. We're doing the modern one today, boys. Gerard Hughes. Good. Gerard Hughes. Are you keeping today? I am keeping today, Bob. Hope you're keeping. We're just going to try full lock on the diffs just to see how it feels. All right. Not really a front end there, okay. Scotty Honeybone. Sev Lopes 208. Gerard Hughes. Good, I am only home from work. Nope. Gear ratios are way too short. I mean, we're already maxed out there. And six gear. Let's try that. Eugene Zabaris. Let's keep it in six the whole time. Streaming hopefully one seven hours face with tears of joy face with tears of joy face with tears of Jeez, for seventeen more hours. I don't know about that one. Oh, I believe I can fly. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're just gonna put the
All right, let's see what we can do here. Eugene Zabaris. Fuoli yai yai amuoli yai. That car is fast. Sweet Lou. I don't know why people are leaving your stream, bro. It happens, buddy. It happens, man. It's no worries. You just like. Try not to say stuff like that. You say stuff like that and people will follow. <laughs> good. Don't ignore it. Just, you know, just ignore it. Have a good time and sh click that share button, man. It's all right. People come and go. Here we go. Come on. Alright, bud. It already happened. No worries. Thanks for the like, guys! Thanks for the like, buddy! Well, it went in the wrong gears there.
DJ Kuel. I've got an Xbox One with steering wheel and pedals. No clutch though. But when I play my steering isn't as sharp any reason. Um, tr I, I've... One second, buddy. You may have your steering saturation a little too low. Try adjusting your steering saturation. Eugene Zabaris, replying to RJ Kuella, do you know where can I get a cheap steering wheel, please? RJ Kuella. Replying to RJ Kuella, Eugene Zabaris, honestly, I got mine on offer up or let go, I would look there. J. Kuella. But I will definitely look for that setting on my Xbox, but I'm not sure the Xbox lets you get that fine tuned. Yeah. I think just my steering has three settings. Yeah, you should, uh, in the game, you go into wheel settings and look for saturation. It's there. I used to race on Xbox. That's what I had to do back in the day. Thanks for the share, buddy. Eugene Zabaris, replying to RJ Kuella, if you get anything please PM me, I would really appreciate it, thanks but Holy crap, 747, are you kidding me? Wow, that was nuts. I had to catch my breath after that one, guys. Holy fuck. Oh my god. That was nuts. That was crazy.
sweet wood. Now that is fast. Go put some music on for a second. Holy crap. Whew. Where did I put my telefonino? I'll be right back, guys. I gotta catch my breath after that one. J. Kueller. Is this game PC only? Eugene Zabaris. How much longer will you be streaming? Hello friends, I am back. We're gonna do one more run. But uh Yeah, we're gonna do one more run. Cause I am getting tired. Holy smap smokes, man. Whew. How's everyone doing today guys? I think it is on PS4. All right, last run. Here we go. Let's see what we can do, guys. You guys think we can get in 730s? Let's see if we can get 730s. Marco Myring, doing rec best carrier. Hell yeah, buddy. Nope, we're going to restart. One more. What kind of music is this? What is this? Let's get a... and hand brake engage All right, here we go. Here we go. Oh, I just killed somebody. All right, we're going to switch. Yeah, we're going to All right, we're going to go sequential. My arm is getting dead, guys. I've been doing this for 3 hours. My arm is absolutely dead right now. So, 
I'm gonna go sequential and uh, just looking for the Allen key should be up oh, there it is got it to be able to switch but we're gonna go sequential st sequential stick so I'm still I'm just not gonna be using my clutch hey if you guys are enjoying the stream click that like button Almost done, guys. Oh, face with tears of joy, face with tears of joy. Almost done, guys. Almost done, guys. Didn't work there. Here we go. Last attempt. Last attempt. I may just be getting really tired, guys. I think that's what's happening, man. I've been giving it my all for three hours straight. Yeah, I think I'm just out of energy. That's to be honest. My brain's dead. My body's just physically exhausted from doing H pattern this whole time. We're just going to take it smooth. Yeah. All right, guys. 
<laughs> I'm absolutely destroyed, tired, exhausted. I've been racing hardcore all day long, guys. So that's going to be it for me today, guys. Uh, <laughs> let's go to the lobby. Eugene Zabaris. Have a good day, see you tomorrow. Jimmy Fukin Win. You're muted, bro. Okay, so what I was saying, guys, is uh, um, thanks for stopping Jimmy by and hanging out with me. I don't have audio from you, just Betty. Yep, yeah, yeah, I, Sweet I see blue. that. Sorry about that, guys. Cannot I, hear you, bro. Yep, yep, fixed it. Sorry about that, guys. Um, so yeah, uh, I had an absolute blast. Um, so I'm not gonna be streaming tomorrow, but I use Monday through Wednesdays to uh d take care of stuff that I have to, and it allows me to re uh regenerate, not regenerate, re-energize. Uh, so whenever I come back on Thursdays, I am full of energy and ready to rock and roll. Uh, cause like, guys, I give it my all. Every time I stream here, I give it my all. I, I do the best I can and try as hard as I can to be as, uh, sociable and communicative with you guys as possible. You know, um, you know, that's why I just get so burnt out after three hours, three, four hours of streaming is because I'm trying to give the best show as I can. You know, I'm trying to connect with you guys. And, uh, you know, form relationships with you guys, but at the same time, race harder than any other streamer that you're going to watch. You know what I mean? So it's like, it's super, super <laughs> exhausting. But, you know, I do the best I can because, you know, like I, I have to be able to prove myself and stand apart from every other streamer to be successful. So I try to race as fast as I can, set world records, you know. But, uh, and talk to you guys at the same time, but like after three hours, Eugene man, Zabaris. I'm, All just, good. See I'm you then. done. <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> All right, guys, I'll see you guys on Thursday. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. And uh, I look forward to hang, uh, hanging out with you guys on Thursday. We've got another, the last round of the, uh, no, the last two rounds of the Ford Fest Championship. So, All right. Jimmy Fukin win. Thanks, Extreme Jimmy. Man. Appreciate it, Jimmy. Sweet wood. See you guys later. Thanks for hanging out with me.